When you visit the dentist, your doctor checks for cavities and other dental problems. But did you know they're also looking for oral cancer? Oral cancer appears as a growth or sore that doesn't go away. It includes cancers of the lips, tongue, cheek, floor of the mouth, hard and soft palate, sinuses, and throat. And if it's not treated early, it can be life-threatening. Men face twice the risk of developing oral cancer as women, and men who are over age 50 face the greatest risk. In fact, it's the sixth most common cancer among men. There are many other risk factors, but one of the biggest is smoking or using tobacco. About 90% of people with oral cancer use a tobacco product. The good news is, it's not just your dentist who can check for signs of oral cancer. You can too. Conduct a self-exam once a month. With a light and a mirror, look around your lips, mouth, cheeks, tongue, and gums for any changes. And if you notice any symptoms like swelling, bumps, and rough spots in or around the mouth, velvety white or red patches in the mouth, unexplained bleeding in the mouth, unexplained numbness or tenderness in the face, neck, or mouth, sores on the face, neck, or mouth that don't heal within two weeks, difficulty chewing or swallowing, hoarseness or a chronic sore throat, a painless mass on the neck. Schedule an appointment with your dentist and healthcare provider. If any tissue looks suspicious, a biopsy can confirm cancer. Oral cancer can be scary, but if caught early, it is curable. Pay attention to any changes in your mouth, get regular dental checkups, and make some positive lifestyle changes to help decrease your risk. Remember, early detection is key.